Yo, today we are going to be figuring out if Tubnet is good or bad, so let's get right into it. To figure out if Tubnet is good or bad, I'm going to be doing a bunch of tests. For every test that I do, I'm going to be giving it a rating 1 out of 10, so let's see how the server holds up. The first game I'm going to be playing is Crystal Rush. So I'm in my first game, and I'm going to start mining away at my crystal. Honestly, this part is extremely boring, and I don't like it. So honestly, for me, that's kind of an L. But I'll let you know my final score at the end of this game. Defend my crystal nexus thingy majiggy. All right, first rush. Let's go. Come on. Boom, 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 boom. Come on, come on. This guy has not done anything yet. Come on, come on. This is my first, gonna be my first tub net kill in full version. Let's go. Let's get some diamond armor, heck yeah. I need to go to mid so that I can get some of the better crystals, I think. Holy smokes, this minefield has a ton. I mean, look at this, there's so many here. Come on now, come on now. I really just do not like the fact that you have to break the crystals. That is such an L for me, dude. I just don't like sitting here and breaking crystals all day. I wanna be moving around and killing people, you know? But maybe that's just me, I don't know. One thing I do know is I'm about to be the most stacked person in this game because I'm just collecting so many crystals. Okay, we have encountered somebody to fight. I have diamond armor, so I should win this. I barely won that, oh my goodness. I need to run away ASAP. Holy smokes, that was way too close. That was way too close, but I'm about to go back to this guy's base and hopefully, hopefully I can beat him. Oh my goodness, I lost. Are you serious? Oh, uh, this guy's attacking me. I don't know what to do. I'm just gonna run away. Bye. No! Okay, so I'm playing a second game because I embarrassingly lost that one way too fast. Okay, here we go to my opponent. Come on. Let's go. Get their crystal. Come on, come on. Let's go! I think one thing I discovered is that when you die in this, like right now, I died, and I think when I respawn, even though I bought diamond armor, I think it downgrades me to iron. Yep, that's correct. Honestly, that's kind of frustrating, and I think they should change that feature. This part is so boring. Please get rid of this tub net. Please, if any admins are watching, please get rid of this. Oh my gosh, please go away. Die. 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 No way, dude. Did he die? Dude, he did die. Oh my gosh. Yeah, that's one thing I want to address right now, actually, is when you fall into the void, you die way too soon. What? I literally flew. As you could see in my last clip, I also tried to fly when I fell in the void, and I didn't do it in time, even though I was barely under where I fell. I actually enjoyed playing Crystal Rush, and way more than I did the first time I did a video on this server. Although I cannot look past mining the crystals the entire game, that is just such a turnoff for me. At the end of the day, I much rather just go play Hypixel Bedwars and have a lot more fun. And for those reasons, I'm gonna have to give Crystal Rush a 6 out of 10. Time to play some Valorant. Uh, um, I, I, I mean Light Strike, sorry. If you didn't already know, Light Strike is basically CSGO or Valorant, but in Minecraft, which Hypixel also has their own version of. So let's see how this holds up. All right, my teammates are confused and I'm confused. I honestly don't know where to go. As someone who's never played CSGO or Valorant, but has played the Hypixel version, I'm just honestly confused because I've barely played that either, but you know, I'm having fun. Oh my gosh, I have no idea what we're supposed to be doing. I'm dead. Get away from me, get away from me, get away from me. No! Oh my gosh, we lost. So apparently you get money to upgrade your weapons, so that's helpful. I bought this crossbow in hopes of making me good at the game. I mean, obviously it's not going to make me good, but hopefully I can help my teammates now. Come on, come on. I think I just killed that guy, but I'm not fully sure. No. Honestly, these upgrades are super cool. I think I'm going to have a lot of fun with this. 
It's only me and my teammate because we're losing and everybody likes to be defending as opposed to offense. So yeah, this isn't looking so good for us. I don't really know how I'm supposed to know where the bomb is planted, but you know, that's cool. Come on. I'm running away from my life. We stand no chance in this 2v4. I'm not sure if it's super confusing on what I'm supposed to do or if I'm just brain dead and lost, but I have no idea what I'm supposed to do with this thing and where to plant it. Okay, it needs to be on site A or B. That is helpful to know. Does this count as site A or B? Where can I place this thing? This is so confusing. I am not sure if Light Strike is just super confusing or if I am just super stupid, but I could not figure out where to place the star or where to break the star. I know it's in lot A, but I just could not find it. I think that this game mode has a lot more potential than Crystal Rush, and I also absolutely loved the custom weapons that I was able to purchase mid-game. And for that reason, I'm going to be giving Light Strike a 7 out of 10. The last thing I want to do is join a full lobby and see if it's laggy or not. So I joined the lobby and it's actually not too laggy. Earlier when I joined, it was super laggy and none of the chunks were loading. But now 30 minutes later, it seems like they have actually fixed it. For that, I'm gonna give it a 10 out of 10. Although I am getting 55 FPS and that may depend on your computer. I know some people with lower end computers than mine will probably be getting close to zero FPS. One more thing I want to add is that Tubnet is barely getting any players. At peak hours of the day, it's getting around 500 players, and at times like now, it's barely getting over 100 players. For the overall server, I'm going to be generous and give it a 7 out of 10. I say generous because I think I just need to give it the benefit of the doubt and wait for future updates, because the server is still fairly new, so I have to be gracious to them. But it was fun, except for mining those horrible crystals. Please get rid of those.